Guys, there, it's just working. I think it's just working. Hello, it's lovely to see you. My name is SK Shlomo, and welcome to my Thursday night stream. I am here every Thursday for the foreseeable future until I'm allowed to go back out on stage. This is my only way of connecting with the world, so it's so great to be here. Thank you very much for tuning in every single Thursday. It's been such an adventure over the last few weeks. So thank you, thank you to everyone. Uh, how are you all doing? I hope you're okay. Please tell me, where are you watching from? And are you watching live or on the replay? So hit me up in the chat right now or the comments. Tell me uh, live or replay and tell me where you are in the world. This is an international stream. It's so amazing to have all the people around the world tuning in. Big up to all the people I can see here in the chat already. Big up to Susanna. Van Horn, big up to the Sax Warrior, big up to Johanna E. Black, big up to Jenny Cookrade, yes Jenny, how are you doing? Big up to Stickle Mouse, he's here every week, I love all these people. Now if you are watching on Imogen's pages, I can't bring your comments up on the stream. So if you want, my comment, if you want your comments to come up on the stream, you need to click this link here, uh, shlow.link slash Imogen stream and go to one of my streams. We're using the software called Restream. It's amazing. It can go out on lots of platforms at once and it can bring in all the comments. We're also going on Imogen's pages and I can't see those comments. So if you want me to be able to interact with you guys, uh, you need to go to this link and click on one of my... We're on YouTube, we're on Facebook, we are on Mixcloud, we're on Twitter, we're on Twitch. We're all over the shop. We're all over the shop. This is going to be good. This is going to be an exciting stream this week. We are going to be making tunes in real time based on your input you guys get to choose what happens i love doing this it's just exciting it's just live it's real it's direct uh, and i've got such an exciting guest joining me this week i am really really excited to have her uh, absolute legend of music in general but also just in this world of like te technology technolo te technological developments in terms of like using technology to express yourself. She is the absolute queen of that world. You know who I'm talking about. I'm talking about Imogen Heap. She's a multi-Grammy winner. She uh, is the inventor of the Mimu gloves. Uh, and she's a composer for like the Harry Potter shows. She's collaborated with people like Taylor Swift, Ariana Grande, so many other people. You don't, you don't need me to, to introduce her. You, you, know, you know who she is. In a minute, I'm gonna bring her on stage. We'll see how she's doing, catch up with her a little bit. I think she's got some exciting news too. She's launched something exciting today which we'll love to hear about. And then this is the format. We are using some software called Endless, which is a brand new technology that enables people to create music 
collaboratively across the internet. Very exciting. So we are going to create three songs in a row. You guys are going to tell us what to do. You're going to suggest lyrics. You're going to suggest the genre. You're going to suggest the style. We're going to do three of these. And then you guys get to choose which one of those you like the best. And we're going to bring that into Ableton, which is my DAW of choice. And um, we're going to work that tune up a little bit more. So one of these tunes is going to get a bit of extra love. And the beautiful thing about it is I'm here in my studio, but Imogen can send me uh, full, st full studio quality audio, essentially, over Endless. So we're going to be testing all that out, having a bit of fun. And you guys get to choose what happens. So how are you guys all doing out there? So excited to see all these mentions and comments coming in. Oh, MC Zadie's in the building. What's up, MC Zadie? Big up MC Zany, like how many times has he been the UK beatbox champion? I don't even know, like about 500 times. Uh, big up to Don, who's watching from the USA. Big up to Casta Zoo, who's watching from Germany. Big up to Monk. Big up to Asia, watching in Bristol. Ed, watching from Kingsgate. Rachel in Minneapolis, there's hundreds of you. This is awesome. Thank you so much for all the shout outs. Keep them coming in. We're going to have loads of fun tonight, but I think it is about time. I introduce you to our absolute super mega superstar guest. Are you guys ready to meet our guest, everybody? I said, are you ready to meet our guest? Make sure you've unmuted yourself, Amy, before I bring you on. Please go crazy for the living legend that we call Emma Journey. Hello. That's what I did earlier. Hello. 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 I apologise. You look pretty judged today. You look more, you look more judged than I do. <laughs> I'm judging the nighty, the pre-bed attire. I, like I it, have man. actually my daughter and uh, Scout's dad um, over there in the um, the sofa bed um, because Scout loves you actually. And um, <laughs> we Hi, went Scout. to see you in Leicester Square. She can't see you right now, um, but oh, okay. slow's waving at you. Can. Oh, he, she can. She's I like, can. Kinda. <laughs> okay. So she's going to hopefully be able to sleep uh, through this jam and uh, then I will join her directly in bed. Uh, we'll make it very peaceful then for Scout's benefit. <laughs> um, how old is Scout these days? Um, Scout is six. Oh, what yes. a big girl. Yay. Six. Oh, I love it. I loved it when she came to see my show. I do a show for yeah. kids, although I haven't been able to do it for a year now, but uh, I'm really excited about bringing it back as soon as it is legal to do so. Um, yeah, and how are you doing? Are you, you've, you've had some exciting news today, right? You've, you've launched something really exciting. We have. Um, we have launched Glover. Um, so Glover is the secret magic um, connecting tissue, really, from with the gloves to Ableton or Endless or whatever you're using, or both. Um, and we've also launched Gliss, which is a free app. Well, you can't really do anything. Uh, what? got my torch on for some reason um you can't really do anything with it unless you have glover but it means that you can use your phone uh, as a con as a gestural controller to ableton if you get um glover and gliss which is free and glover is the yeah the tool so basically glover is here in my computer here it is and i can map any gesture whether it's my gloves or any external thing really um including the phone and um map it to record or choose an instrument or choose an effect or whatever i want to do so yeah that's the plan that's and we did it today exciting. and we got a great couple of reviews around um one in engagenet which is in, in gadget sorry um and yeah we're quite excited it's it, we've had it obviously since new well some version of it since day dot since 10 years ago but it's yeah. the first time we've launched it outside of um those with the gloves so you can just use it with a leap motion or some other gestural interface that you might have have you got it set up now is it something you can sort of demo to us what you, you know how you're using it um well i say that and of course my wi-fi <laughs> has just uh, gone down <laughs> everything's Anyways. fine there we go there we go um okay so i'm completely not really fully prepared for this i'm afraid i know i should be more prepared um but i'm not because i had quite a lot going on but um i will do something Let's see what happens. Um, 
oh yes because i'm in solo because you don't want to hear my voice multiple times so yeah um so now if i wanted to say add a reverb to my piano Same with the voice. So I just clenched my fist and created a, a loop. And I could create another one. That's a terrible loop. It's a terrible example. just with your hands um and then gliss is um so this is early days i've literally just tried first integration of endless which i absolutely love in fact tim exile who's a creator of endless is my main inspiration for doing the gloves 10 years ago i was like this man has created this genius system and he made a dream come true for himself i'm gonna make a dream come true for myself and create gloves with music we love um, tim he's here by the way big up to tim he's just commented he's watching on twitch he says bonsoir glover is amazing we do oh, love bless. tim um so tim yeah saw him play and i was like he's awesome and amazing and ever since then I've kind of developed the gloves with this amazing team who made they do all the work now and i just enjoy their amazing work um and what they've released with glover is just fantastic and gliss as well so literally two days ago or the day before two days three days ago um i tried gliss with glover and endless and it's like the beginnings and and the gloves controlling endless and it's the beginnings of my dream country. Um, so, yeah, I could quickly demo just a little thing. You can't really see, but because my mic's in the way. Look, if I move the mic, no, can't. No, wherever I go, the mic's in the way. Anyway, there's endless. Let's just, um, so if I was to, first of all, I'll make a little loop, just a little piano thing. Um,
mega cool guys so let's have a little round of applause for Glover that's cool it's cool it's nerdy it's cool and if you give me like half a year um, it's going to be really integrated and amazing and try and get Tim to give me addressable messages so that I can access direct um, effects that I might want at any one time hello yeah hello, Tim. For the same. Um, um, yeah. He's he's giving you lots of love here Tim he's saying uh, massive massive oh, love good. gang you opened worlds for me I dedicate it all to you um, oh, everyone's loving okay. your uh, your setup here. Uh, there's Lucy on on Twitch is asking if you could maybe turn your light, mic level up a tiny bit, Emmy, so we can hear you over the music. Uh, when although we have got a different setup we're going to use now, haven't we? So that uh, your mic will come straight to us, but your music will come through endless. Is that right? Yeah, that is right. Now, how I'm going to do that is how did I was I going to do that again? Yes. While you're Sorry, doing that, Emmy, I'm going to get the yeah. crowd involved. Crowd, are you guys there? I can see loads, loads of comments coming in, which is lovely. We are going to we are going to start our first jam in a minute. So just to remind you of the format, we're going to do three short jams over Endless. Myself and Imogen are going to improvise some music together based on your recommendations for style. Uh, in a minute, I'm going to open it up so you can vote. Uh, and you choose what happens. Obviously, then after we've done those three jams, you're going to vote for your favorite one, and we're going to turn that into a more developed song in Ableton. If you've just joined us, my name's SK Shlomo. I'm a world record-breaking beatboxer and live looper. And if you've just joined on Imogen's channels and you want your comments to come up on screen, you might need to pop to one of my channels. So we're streaming on lots of channels, but if you go to schlo.link slash image and stream, you'll be able to go to either my Facebook or my YouTube or, your, or my Twitch, and you can join in there. So in a sec, we are going to open the voting for what, what style you want our first jam to be. Uh, but just before we do that, I want to say, if anyone wants to buy me a coffee, you totally can just here. If you want to support <laughs> an artist who can't tour right now, this is the only way I have of making money. So if you'd like to buy a coffee, I'd love that very much. They cost three pounds. You can buy as many as you want. Uh, so we are going to open it up now. So let me show you how I've got this set up. We're using another platform here called Menti. Uh, if you go to menti.com. Uh, on, on another device, so you don't have to interrupt the stream. Yeah. Get your phone out. Go to menti.com and use the code 9671905. So menti.com, uh, and enter the code 9671905. When you get there, you can type in what uh, what you want this first jam to be like. So it could be a genre, it could be in a, you know some words or some feelings or even just a color or whatever. Whatever you want us to get started with. It's an inspiration point. Um, so it, as soon as someone does that, it should appear up here on my screen. So that, I, I've got a feeling it's not even going to work, but there's always a bit of a time delay. So go, oh, look, someone's already put something in there. Right. They've suggested free jazz. So if anyone else would like to uh, suggest that, go to menti.com, use the code 9671905. You should see it up on the screen there, 9671905. Can you see that as well, Emmy? Is that coming up on your screen? Um Yes. So there's lots Pig. of ideas Whoa. coming in here. Pepper Pig, Spots in Space, Groovy, Scouts Drum and Bass. That's funky. <laughs> should we, I think we should choose that three of these, Emmy, and then we should get a vote on, on three of them and choose the best one. George and Michael, what do you want to put into the vote here? Me. Yeah, let's choose three of these, and then they can vote on the final one of those that we'll use to, to put, put together our first jam. So um, someone said... Uh, Someone said sci-fi mm. horror. Five four. <laughs> Someone's voted five four. <laughs> Could be fun. If we do five four now. Um, Acid house. Me. That's quite so exciting. So should we choose options. between 
acid house. The pig. Peppa Pig's kind of interesting. That would suit my um, six-year-old over here. Okay, so for Scout, <laughs> we can put Peppa Pig in the mix. And then what's the final one that people can vote on? Brooding, Brooding. but hopeful. That's kind of nice, isn't it? Yeah, that's nice. Brooding. Goodness me, I hope you're going to be leading this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be learning from you this evening. You're the expert. Okay, this. guys. So, <laughs> so I'm going to give you... So stay on Menti, because I think I can do this, right? Uh, I think I can give you guys a chance to vote on this as well, right? If I go in here, which option do you vote? So option A is Acid House. Option B is Peppa Pig. And option C is Brooding but Hopeful. Okay, are you ready to vote? I'm going to open up the voting now. So you've got option A, which is Acid House. Option B, which is Peppa Pig. Option C, which is Brooding but Hopeful. Uh, should work on the exact same link you guys are already on. And we will make some music based on that, whatever you vote on. I can see the votes coming in. I always love this. It's so exciting that things happen in real time. You can see that you can interact <laughs> with the world. It always makes me just feel excited. So I'm going to give you guys a few more seconds. You can see lots and lots of votes coming in. So just to remind you, option A, Acid House. Option B, Peppa Pig. Option C, Brooding But Hopeful. Uh, okay, I can see a few more votes. I'm going to give you 10 more seconds to vote. Here we go. 10, 9, 8. Option C seems to be winning, but oh, there's some votes coming in at the last minute for A. 3, 2, 1. Time is up. And the winner is option C. 52% of the votes. That uh, sounds Amy, like the mood. Are you up for making something yeah. bro brooding but Was hopeful? Is that the brooding, beautiful, brooding but hopeful? I guess that's I'm quite good at brooding but hopeful, I think. I guess that's kind of how we are. We're all right now. We're all a bit <laughs> just like we've brooded. We're brooded out, but we've kind of get a bit of hope, right? With vaccines and yes, I don't know what. Okay, cool. That was fun. Yeah, I enjoyed that. Yeah. E even if the rest of the stream goes horribly wrong, but at least that bit worked. Okay, so Emmy. That was good. That was very slick. I'm impressed by your Thanks very data much. gathering. Data gathering. Thanks. Data, data gathering's good. Is the music going to be as good? Who knows? <laughs> All right, so I've got my endless setup here. I've been building a slightly new rig today. Uh, I've been building a controller using an iPad app called Touchable, and that's been nice. quite fun. Oh, yeah, Touchable. Yeah. Uh, but it doesn't look as good as uh, as the one you were just de demonstrating, so I want to get that too. Oh, you're too kind, too kind. Okay, Emmy, we've got a few minutes now. I'm not going to put a timer, but a, a, a short amount of time to create something okay. brooding. Yet hopeful. Okay. Can good. we do that? Do you think we can do it? I think we can do it. Um, Are you on the same uh, endless jam as me? I hope so. so um, I feel like, oh, yeah, I can see the stuff you've been doing there. Like. No, 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 don't listen to that. D mute all. Um, I mute was just literally, all. Delete all. I was just sound checking. <laughs> uh, yeah. So um, if, I, if I stick something right. in it, would you be able to hear it? I, so just for people watching, you'll be able to hear what I'm doing. And then any music you hear now from uh, Emmy is going to be coming through Endless, which is very exciting. Yes, except I need to figure a way to stop you hearing my system <laughs> while I create it. Because um, so at the I moment start, you do. Emmy, once I start playing, I won't be able to hear your voice very well. So I'm going to kind of go in the zone now. Okay. And you're going to take me out of the mix, right? What kind of what tempo? What you want me to say in? What kind of tempo? <laughs> What kind of tempo is like brooding but hopeful going to be? Um, I think like. Mm. Like a kind of. So that mm. played a load of random stuff I wasn't expecting to play, but now we're good. <laughs> <laughs> so I've got a little little jam going here. I'm at kind of uh, where am I at? 74 BPM. Okay. Can you hear that, Emmy? Can you hear that beat now? I will be able to in a moment when I sort my own rubbish stuff that's going on over here out. Um, you can hear it, right? I will be able to in a moment, sorry. <laughs> I've got so many instances of endless going on. Um, okay, play. 
Yeah, I got that. I can't hear you when that's going on, but yes. Okay, I've got. There's something in there. There's some kind of piano stuff left over. Yeah. Is that what you found? Am I in the current jam? Let me just check if I'm in the right jam. Oh, I wasn't in the right jam. I was in a different jam entirely. Okay, I can hear that now. the bass. Give me the bass. I'm in a bass. Bring the bass. Here's the bass. I'll do it now. What just happened? <laughs> I can't tell what I'm listening to. You're just going to have to ignore me, Scout, because I'm talking to what's this? I'm talking to Shlomo. Sorry, my love. Yeah. I can't hear you, my love, because I've got my headphones in. If you like, you're going to get pretty tired. I can't talk to you, my love. Okay, sorry. I've got a bit of a jam going on there, Emmy, but I don't know if you can hear it. I'm not seeing I can hear anything it. coming from you. Thank you to Charlotte Barber for buying got, me a coffee. I sent in the piano. You. Did you not get the piano? No. I can, I can hear it coming through Skype, which I wasn't expecting to. But I can't see it coming in through Endless. Can you hear <laughs> my beats coming in through Endless? Yeah. I'll do it again. Say again. You ready? I'll send you something. Go for it. Oh yeah, I see that. I think yours is an auto updating. I know why I didn't have auto play on this one. That's lovely. Emmy, is there a way you can, uh, remember earlier you turned it off so we couldn't hear your piano through, yeah. through the voice chat? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me try. Otherwise we're hearing it twice. <sighs> i tell you what, okay. I'll just use the mic, the built-in mic on the screen. Can you still hear me? I can hear you, yeah. Okay. You can't hear my piano now. We can What about that? Can you hear me? Mm -hmm. 
differentiate which one I'm recording into and which one I'm hearing back. Um, so I'm just trying to find a way to just mute Skype. Um, but I've got everything looping back into my headphones. It's typical. Yeah, um, I can hear the endless jam coming back to me. Which, uh, when, we, when we sound checked earlier, you, had it, you didn't have that audio coming back. Thanks for the coffee, Linda. Appreciate that. I'm just okay. gonna image and I'm gonna mute you for now in Skype. So yes, that's it, isn't it? Yeah. See if this fixes anything. <laughs> okay, I can't hear you if you want to speak to me, <laughs> but it means that we're no longer getting a feedback loop. Is that better for you? Give me a thumbs up, Amy, if that's better for you. Does that sound better to people at home on a stream? Because I know a bit of people are saying there's a bit of doubling going on and feedback hearing two of us. Uh, 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 uh. Liz Smith says, Imogen is the voice of calm. <laughs> Big up to Liz Smith. Imogen is can the voice of okay, calm. But you can't hear my music, to be right? around in a crisis. Yeah, I can hear you now. But you can't hear the music. Uh, I can't hear the music. Oh no. I'm moving. I just keep moving. And the mood swings. I kept losing. Just keep moving. Ah, 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 ah. Just keep moving. Yeah. Just keep moving. Yeah. Just keep moving. Yeah. Just keep moving. Yeah. Just keep moving. quite fun round of applause everybody if you enjoyed that little thing <laughs> definitely had some brooding but hopeful vibes so i hope, hope you vibes. agree Emmy, how are you doing are you still having a technical nightmare 
Thanks for all the encouragement, guys. There's loads of love coming in on here. Really appreciate it. Big up to Kantiaki Gaming, says Pioneeric Music Tech Stream. Well done both. Yeah, we're trying, we're trying. Big up to Jocelyn watching on YouTube. Big up to Shah watching on YouTube. Big up to Greg Beardsell in the house. Greg Beardsell's in the house, everybody. <laughs> big up to Ivy Pivey watching on YouTube. Loads of people over on YouTube. Uh, big up to Subsonic. Yes, Subsonic. Hi, Shlo and Imogen. Sounds great. How are you doing there, Emmy? Oh, I'm really confused, actually. Sorry. Um, I've got... Oh, man. This is doing my head in. I've got three, four different... Um, trying to get everything to root it through is making it really hard to be able right. to focus on I'm what I can actually music. Yeah. Where, I'm, where I'm from. This is the constant battle of being a music technologist, which is that you... Uh, oh, thank you, Susanna, for the coffee. Loving the collab. Fab grooves, guys. There's Daddy, yeah. And then just... Um, so I feel like that was a good start. Uh, we have done one tune. It was brooding but hopeful. Um, shall we do some more? Should we do another one? Uh, should we make a new end yeah. this time? Should we do another whole vote? Should we go back to the glorious suggestions you guys already gave us? Do you guys want to do a new? Do you want to guys? Do you want to make new suggestions or do you want to use the ones you already did? Give me. A, Give me a steer. What do you guys, what do people want to do? If you just joined us, welcome, welcome. My name's SK Shlomo. I am a beatboxing, live looping kind of dude. And I'm with my friends who I've known a very long time, Imogen Heap. How long have we known each other, Imogen Heap? Something like oh, a decade. Free tech. <laughs> I feel like I'm the first time we, I, I was trying to find videos of you and me together that I could post this week to share to the world. And I found one where, um, uh, the first time we worked together where you came to Glastonbury with us yeah. and um, and you're like uh, in the, there's a little interview and you're like oh yeah I just got this tweet from this guy and he was like I'm playing at Glastonbury do you want to come and I was like oh I better look him up <laughs> oh is that the first time no that can't be the first time is that the first time we met before I tweeted I think the first time we met was in a field in Glastonbury uh, oh, and you nice. came and performed with the vocal orchestra that was good fun yeah that was a good time um Oh man, sorry, Shlo. I'm really struggling with the. I've got so many different routings, um, and because we because we hadn't tested it where I can hear your audio from your from you. You shouldn't be able to hear my. Can you hear my music coming through Skype? I thought I could. Ah, that might be what's confusing things. That shouldn't be happening. Give me a second. I'll open my loop back. Make sure that's not happening. Thank you, T Mids, for the coffee. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. That means a lot. Uh, loop back. So listen, while, while I'm uh, doing that, I can see loads and loads of suggestions are still here on this. Let me put it back up. So if you want to suggest some more ideas for our next jam, all you need to do is head to this website. It's called menti.com and you enter a special code. Uh, do it on another device. Do it on your phone or something. Go type in the code 96719059. Uh, there's lots and lots of suggestions in here already. Keep them coming, because we're going to choose another three of them to vote from in a second. Uh, whilst you're voting, I am going to see why Amy can hear. Uh, oh, maybe I put my settings wrong in Skype. <laughs> Keep those suggestions when I'm coming playing, in. I see some good ones. Synth wave, that so looks like an interesting one. Can you hear me, Shlo? I can. Can you hear if I play the piano? Can you hear that? No. Good. Okay, that's something at least. <laughs> okay. So you shouldn't be able to hear my endless. Let me just play it. Can you hear that, Emmy? No, I can't hear. It. Say again. I can't. So that's good. Okay. And then I said, "Have we fixed it? Have we fixed it?" Um, you fixed it from your end. <laughs> amazing. Okay, good. Thank so you. everybody watching, thank you so much, everyone at home. Uh, loads of amazing suggestions in here. Uh, big up to Felicia Dressler, who's liked the stream. Thank you, Felicia. If you go to menti.com, M-E-N-T-I.com, and use the code 9671905, I'm going to give you another 10 seconds to suggest some ideas for our next song. There's one there I really like, Amy. Can you see them? There's one there I really like, oh, Snow in the Morning. That's Snow in the Morning. That's I like Snow in the Morning. 
That's a lovely bubbles, idea. Bubbles, 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 aspirational break core. Whimsical mischief. Oh, I quite like whimsical mischief. Whimsical mischief. That can be our second. Um, pink moon. That could be appropriate considering Sophie. Um, pink moon. Pink moon. So many on here, guys. This is amazing. Massive bass flaps. Nice. Uh, death metal, euphoric post-apocalyptic, euphoric post-apocalyptic tech jazz. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we've got snow in the morning, got whimsical mischief. Let's have one more. What should we have? Uh, a UK garage type beat. Do you fancy doing some too. UK garage? What do you think, Emmy? So many to choose from. So many things I've never attempted. <laughs> um, uh, I don't know. I'm kind of drawn towards Pink Moon. Pink Moon. Yeah, wicked. All right. So we've got three options here, guys. I'm going to put it onto pink the... Moon. I'm I'm two it choices on, so Something about Pink. I'm going to put it on the vote page now. If you ever need this software, I think it's, it's, it's really cool. It's totally free. What's it called? Uh, Menti. Uh, so oh, I'm going to reset the vote from this because we've already had a vote. Uh, and you're going to have three options, guys. You can choose option A, which is snow in the morning. Option B, whimsical mischief. Or option three, pink moon. Option C, I mean. So we're going to spend a few minutes making, uh, making one of these into a song and then... We're gonna, we've done that once already. We're going to do it two times more. Then you guys get to vote on which one you like the best for us to whip into Ableton and start turning into like a finished song. So, uh, is, that, is that working? Oh, voting is closed. Uh, didn't give them much choice, did you? Much didn't, chance? I didn't give them any time. Okay, here we go. <laughs> it's open. They're all coming in. All right, so just to remind you, option A is snow in the morning. Option B is whimsical mischief. Option C is pink Moon, what do you going to see me and Imogen Heap make for you using like our... Pink Moon, Pink Moon was option C. Pink Moon was option C. So just yes. to remind everyone, Snow Go in the Morning, Pink option moon. A. Come on, Pink Moon. Whimsical Mischief, option B. Pink Moon's winning, he's in a winning position. Pink moon. Loads of Pink Mooners. Thank you, PJ Solano, for buying me a coffee. That's very kind of you. Yeah. How much is it? Coffee go for I, I might spend it on food for my children if that's okay because I'm not a massive <laughs> coffee drinker. I'm giving up <laughs> okay, I'm going to give you 10 more seconds till we close the vote. Uh, six, five, four, three, two. It's a clear winner, though, guys. It's a very clear winner. So, listen, I'm being super ignorant, but what, what is Pink Moon? What does that mean? I don't know what it means, but. Um, it makes me think of Sophie because she was climbing up a mountain or I don't know where she was climbing up actually. I just assumed it was a mountain, but somewhere to get closer to the moon. Is that what and happened? Then, and then she died. So. That's really, really sad. Do you know Sophie? No, I don't. Amazing. I, I don't know amazing her. producer. Yeah. Yeah. She died. She died a few days ago. Well, let's dedicate this to her. That's um, Yeah. Terribly sad. Absolutely. So this goes out to Sophie, who uh, who's in inspired us to make some music around the theme of Pink Moon. If you've yes. just tuned in, I'm SK Shlomo. This is Imogen Heap. And we are making music in real time using software called Endless. Big up to all the Endless crew. We love you very, very much. Uh, literally complete game changer for me, this software. So it's really fun to play with. It is. Um, let's make some music. At the right time, so. Came out just the right time. It's completely free okay. on iOS, guys. So if anyone else wants to jam, well, maybe we won't open it up right now, but if you want to jam with other people around the world in real time, it's free if you have an iOS device. So, Pink Moon. Okay. I need to work out how to start a new jam without playing the last one, because that's what keeps happening. I've got it. Don't worry, I've sorted it. Sorted it. Just hang on a minute. I've got it. She's got it. She's got it sorted. Um, well, I say that, but 
let's see if it works in this context. Susanna Ooh. says, uh, Susanna watching on Twitch says, Pink Moon is also a great song by Nick Drake. I did not know that. See, education. And the other Susanna says, that's why I wrote Nick Drake in the suggestions. Ha ha. <laughs> cool. Tim Exar says, Sophie was Bowie reincarnated. Shah says, Sophie is phenomenal. Oh, such a sad feeling. Oh, we've got some music here. I feel like that's coming at a tempo that I've set it at. What tempo have you, have you got that at? 79.97. Are you, is it Again. not coming in? At, if you adopt tempo. I've got it set to slave to my Ableton, so it can't tell. Oh, no. To, if you get it to you, you at, adopt. Uh, new riffs adopt current tempo. Does that, but does that no, force Ableton into that tempo, though? That's what I you like turn that off, sorry. And then. Thanks for the coffee, Rostov crew. Um, what did you say, Amy? So, what tempo are you at, though? And then I'll just set it to that manual um, for now. 97.97, a I nice round so. number. I thought it would be a nice palindromic number. 97.97. OK, I'm going to add some little something. Oh, wow, that's beautiful, Amy. You got that? It's nice, isn't it? 
just crashed oh no <laughs> that was fun that was good round of applause oh my goodness Ableton uh, just crashed thank you everybody for all the love coming in this is so lovely um <laughs> so much love coming in like big up to ali saying keep being brilliant she's watching on facebook Look up to Johanna on YouTube, says she feels like flying. Lucy says, Imi, your voice is just mesmerizing. Israel. Oh, Israel's in the house. Big up to Israel. <laughs> Late, but I made it. Sounds really good. This is cool. Guys, where are you watching from? Tell us where you're watching from. Tell us how you're feeling. Tell us how you're doing. This is a crazy time. So many people <coughs> can't be doing what they want to be doing. So we're excited to have you with us right now. How are you doing, Imi? Did you just say that uh, Ableton just crashed? Yeah. Oh my gosh. It did. That happened to me a lot of times today. Like when I load Endless, sometimes it just, Ableton just disappears. It's because it's not ready for its greatness. Yeah. It's, it, it, Ableton just can't cope with the amazingness of Endless. Exactly. <laughs> okay, guys. So that was our second jam. That was called Pink Moon. Don't forget, you've got to vote in a minute for That'd which of these three so we're going to take into the kind of studio mode. So we've got Pink Moon. That was our second jam. The first one was called Brooding, Yet Hopeful. Uh, so what are we going to do for our third jam? Um, let's take some more votes, guys. So I feel like what I'm going to do is bring back the Menti, right? Uh, bring that back. So let's go back to the other setting where we can see your words and suggestions. Give us a genre or inspiration, but what I'm going to do, yeah, is I'm going to reset it. So we'll start again. Reset results. Reset results. So, <laughs> so there's so many good ideas in there, but let's start fresh. Now you know what we're capable of. <laughs> um, what do you guys want us to do for our last of the three jams? Uh, let me open the voting. So if you've just joined us, we're going to make a piece of music in real time. Based on your inputs, you just got to go to menti.com and use the code 9671905. Are you going to choose a tempo before we start? Because it would help me enormously if that was the case. Totally um, handy. Let's, let, I can totally do that. Should we see what, what people want us to make? And we'll choose a tempo. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We can Dude, choose a tempo. Can you see all these coming in, Emmy? 
Uh, yes. It's, it's very nice. Popcorn, I like that. Popcorn. We're, we're all in need villain of song. entertainment. Turquoise sunset, Scooby Doo, Glitter Bomb, Board Cat. This, this is so fun. I, lo I just love it. I wish you guys were here. Those times when I just can't think of anything to make. Um, I'm just done with doing stuff by myself. I'm going to live stream everything. I'm making my second album in the next couple of months, and I'm basically going to use this as my platform to do it. You guys give me inspiration. Superstar guests, like you know, uh, of the oeuvre of Imogen Heap. Like, what a dream come true. Let's let's yeah. use the internet. Let's use the tools. Let's make music. Okay, so what should we choose out of these three, Emmy, to to uh, create um, the vote? Right, I'm just trying to delete the star. Um, someone wants me to. Right. Well, someone thinks well, it should be nine okay. six seven one nine zero five. I feel uh, like I've like already popcorn. done that, guys. <laughs> I like popcorn. I think we should just make a really, really entertaining piece of music. Yeah, those first two were pretty kind of uh, yeah, brooding, obviously, because that's what they asked for. But yeah, maybe play on a Sunday morning. That's kind of close to Pink Moon. Should we do the Valley of the Cat. There's lots of cat references within your fans. Valley of the Cat. Uh, Valley of the Cat. Be a cat. What should we Valley do? Of the cat. Uh, should we? Do you like Valley of the Cat? Do you want to put that in the vote? Maybe. Um, and it just ocean, ocean of love. I like that. Ocean of love. Glitter bomb. Yeah, I like glitter bomb. Glitter bomb. I think we should do something really upbeat and like woo. Yeah, let's do something upbeat and woo. That's something that I would never normally do because usually I'm very brooding. Yeah, brooding. <laughs> uh, well, listen. What was the one you just said that sounded quite upbeat? Is up there somewhere. Look, there's a board cat there. It's definitely, we're definitely not going to be doing board cat, I don't think. I, like, I feel like we're going to do something energetic. I like to find words that are energetic. What did you, what, which one did you say? It Is was on the right-hand side. Look, dark kitten. It's dark. cat vibes. Oh. No, not that one, it? It wasn't, it wasn't cat, dark kitten. I feel like I can't control this. You guys are in control. I, I don't have any option of that. Staling, sailing oh. through dense chemical clouds on a faraway planet. It's very specific. I'm like it's very specific. Dream. What was the one you said a second ago that felt really upbeat? I've lost it. Uh, it was up, up, part way up from dark kitten. Can you scroll up or? I can't. Maybe I can if I change, change the settings, change the emotional picture. Yeah. There's different yeah. things on here of how you want it to be. There's one by one speech bubbles. Try that speech bubble. See what that looks like. Uh, glitter bomb. That's what. Glitter I bomb. Yeah. All right. So we've got popcorn. We've got glitter bomb. Oh, sorry. That's in the same. The same. They're really They're related, aren't they? These two. And I've got another one that you said earlier. Ocean of love. So should we make them the three votes? Sure. Yeah. Okay, guys. Give me another sec. I'm going to switch this back to vote mode. Disney um, villain song. Oh, You've got three options to vote on. Uh, someone's already voted for option C. So, op so option A is popcorn. Option B is ocean of love. And option C is glitter bomb. So mm. place your votes now. We're going to make a piece of music based around that idea. If you've just tuned in, I'm SK Shlomo. This is my good friend Imogen Heap. We're making music together in real time. Yeah. We've made two songs already today. Well, it's a bit of a stretch to just call them a song. I'm, like, call it, um, I'm calling them a song, stretch or not. They're songs. Yeah, it's a song. song it. we've, song written, we've written two songlets already and we're about to write a third. <laughs> and then one of them we're going to kind of flesh out a little bit into slightly even... Into our biggest hit yet. Yeah, <laughs> we're going to create a smash hit right in front of you. Oh, so get your votes see. in. Yeah. Uh, if you just join us, menti.com, yeah, 961905. Uh, so just to remind you what the options are, A is popcorn, B is ocean of love, and C is glitter bomb. I'm going to give you another 10 seconds before we close the vote. And you can choose which one of them you want. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, <laughs> one. You have gone for option C, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for the votes. We're going to be making a glitter bomb right now, Emmy. How do you feel about that? Feeling good about that. I'm feeling yeah. that. That's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. So, um, do you say you want a tempo in advance? Yes, please. How about something like a kind of. Uh... <laughs> 
Oh, I've done that thing again. It's played the last track at a different tempo. Uh, no, so I like I'd it. It does that. One one four three seven. One one four three seven. One one four three seven. Well, very precise. But if I put a loop in at that tempo, will that not set your a not set? Will that not set your endless to be in that tempo? Yeah, but that's what you. That's what we want, right? Yeah, you wanted it to be in. So should I just start with putting a beat into endless? Yeah. Okay, let's try it. <laughs> Okay, let me try something. Look, there's a blank riff, just made it. Can you hear that? I will in a moment. No. Wait a minute. Why not? Glitter bomb. Headphones. Should be able to hear that. Should be able to hear it. Can't hear it. No, it's not updating. Um, you've made one. It's coming in here, but not coming in here. Are you having? Are you having tech? I'm always having tech problems. Tech it's mares. Imaging. I love I love the way you just handle it. Like I get in a bit of a flat whereas you're just like, ah, oh, this isn't working. I've started using the term. Well, that's because you care about your fans and you're like, oh, my poor <laughs> fans, they're watching and I'm just flapping around. And I'm like, eh, I got my own stuff. No, not really. Of course I can't. Yeah, I, I just feel that like is I the can show, relax isn't it? into that, being. That becomes the show. I, I like it. Yeah. Oh, I don't know why it's not playing. <laughs> Oh, oh, okay, maybe, maybe that. Come on, give me a, give me a, oh, mm, okay, so oh, right. We've okay, got, we've got live it. captions anyway. on, right, on Facebook. I'll do it Ollie, the captions interpret yeah. image and heap as Im image and heat. Image and heat. Yeah. <laughs> That's me. That's your new, your new nickname. So glitter bomb, we're on glitter bomb. Image and Oh, what have I done? I'm not used to jamming with other people. Did you say something? I, I said in... I'm not used to jamming with other people. I'm used to living in my own universe. I'm not used to adopting other people's tempos and things like that. Is it working, though? Damn you. Selfish. Self-centred. <laughs> Sorry. What can I do? Uh, Lucy says, this better make me feel like a giant glittery sparkly mess or I'll be disappointed. All right, thanks for the pressure, Lucy. We'll <laughs> do our best. It will, it will. Just get, I just need to get my stuff going. I feel like I'm just going to get into it and then it's going to be like, okay, that's the end of the session. Yeah, that's, the, that's the way of it, though. Is Why? it playing? Why? Is it working? No, it's not. It's not. I'm just going to unload. I'm going to come in and out of live. Oh, thanks for the coffee, Liz Smith. Thank you very much. Here's some fireworks. Sound effect for you. <laughs> I'm going to keep jamming with this glitter bomb, Immy, whilst you sort of fix it. Yeah, that please up. do. Uh, I'm not far off. I'm just going to try and get Ableton to tell it what I want to do. Or I could plumb in this keyboard into that computer. But then I wouldn't be able to play the piano. Oh, this this doesn't sound like it needs a piano. This song. it sounds like it needs like cool sounds. So I'm gonna unplug my piano. And I'm gonna play it with this computer. No, able to just not not happening. Ooh, yes. Come on, Ableton. 
face it, I've got a really way over complicated system for what we need to achieve today. <laughs> right, what did you say? What temper did you say it was? 90, no, 114, was it? 100. Slow. Is it working in me yeah <laughs> you don't sound convinced right i'm just gonna sing okay. <laughs>
Oh well, I'm just gonna use the piano because I can't. Stream, so, I'm just yeah, just, just so that you don't hear it yeah. twice, basically. Yes, makes yeah. sense, makes sense. Thanks for all your applause, okay. everybody. That's very kind of you. You're such kind people. Okay. Thank Tuning you. in. My name's SK Shlomo. Okay. I am here with my buddy Imogen. We have made three songlets, as we're calling them. That last oh, one yeah. was called Glitter Bomb. It actually came out <coughs> pretty like dark and aggressive. I know, it was. it's not, it's not really glittery. It wasn't very like, Ooh. maybe it's like, just, like uh, just the filth came out for some reason. <laughs> uh, but that's okay, filth is good. All right, guys. Because he threw in like an augmented, or a, what is it, a diminished fifth or something. It's like that eerie. Yeah, kind of spooky. Yeah, angry, spooky angry glitter bomb says, bard of many things. He's tuned in on Twitch. Big up to you. Um, everybody, if you've just joined in, I'm SK Shlomo. If you are watching this on Imogen's channel, we're going out on lots of different channels at once, but if you're on Imogen's channel, I can't see your comments. If you want your comments to be able to appear on the stream, uh, you need to hop over onto on a, one of my channels. Like, and neither can I. Because um, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm just got enough to focus on. Uh, so to this link here, shlo.link slash Imogen stream, and that will give you a link. You can either go Facebook, YouTube, or... Twitch or wherever you want really but if you want to come in like all these lovely people big up to Jocelyn Thompson who loved it thank you very much big up to Ali who says chimes or a bell would give you some glitter that's a good idea mm -hmm. Susanna Schlow you're a little bit quiet that, that's something that no one's ever said to me hello 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 is that better I'm telling that I'll never shut up <laughs> is that now distorting or is it okay not in a bad way. Um, big up to 
Uh, Orla, watching on YouTube, he's just giving us applause. We like that. We're performers. We need that kind of business. You have no idea how it feels to be a performer who isn't able to just go up on stage. And I literally just have dreams about it. Have, have, you, have you been struggling, Emmy, with the with the non-performing? Well, I'm, I haven't really done much performing for six years because of a little somebody in my life. <laughs> um, and also because there's just been a lot of other stuff going on. But, but I just kind of, I got into the swing of it. Um, then Scout went, to, this is, you have to try and fit it into schooling, don't you? Yeah, it's School. tricky. It is tricky. Uh, yeah, I just, but, um, on, I'd, I was the same. I'd kind of hadn't been touring for a little while and then really went out hard. 2019 was going hard and 2020 was going to be really, really hard. I had like mm -mm. over 100 shows cancelled. I'm glad, that, cancelled. I'm glad we, I did manage to get in a tour just before, which, which is quite well timed. Round of applause for that. That's amazing. Big up to Ali Dan's watching on YouTube. Says, has quarantine been helpful for your creativity, though? I think so. I've I've sat here every Thursday doing stuff like this. Uh, you know, it's been really fun messing around, finding new ways to be creative. It's something I've meant to do for years. Do more live streaming. How about you, Emmy? Has it been better for your creativity? Um, it's been good at kind of kind of funneling time, finding specific time to be creative because. Um, I'm with Scout almost 24/7, so it's less easy to. I might be having lots of creative ideas. I've done I've done lots of very very late nights <laughs> um, yeah, to man. try and do the stuff that I can't do in the day because um, Scout's not at school. I hear you. Big up to Mason watching on YouTube. He says that wasn't a glitter bomb. It was right. a nail bomb. <laughs> do you want your money back? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Um, it was it was kind of more hard. It was kind of more aggressive than. Uh, Maybe we glitter. should just, you know, just dial up the tempo, a couple of. Yeah. Like fifty BPM or something might sound more. <laughs> I feel like we got something. It's kind of dubstepy. I don't even know where that came from, but you know, it's fun. It's fun. So listen, guys, we have made three pieces of music for you. You're welcome, absolutely, you know, just for the fun of it. Uh, but what we want to do now in the second half of the stream is we are going to plonk one of these jams into Ableton uh, and kind of work on it in a slightly more linear way with your input, everybody at home. So thank you so much for your votes so far. We're going to do another vote now, and that vote is going to be for which of these three tunes you want us to hear us work on a bit more. Uh, and we're going to use Endless in a different way this time. So you can use Endless... Uh, in your on your desktop on your um, in your DAW so I can kind of drag everything we've done into a track and then for example if I'm like oh we need another bass line or we need some vocals or something and Imi could in theory pump that through into my studio from hers uh, using Endless so that's what we're going to try out okay. next yeah What's your beck and call um, so before we do that, I just want to big up all the people who are watching from, I've got a community called the Creation Lounge, which is a bunch of people who like making stuff. Uh, and we have a monthly giveaway for our creation challenge. If you want to join our group, we're currently on WhatsApp. We might need to move to Discord or something, but at the moment we're on WhatsApp. It's slow.link slash WhatsApp if you want to join. And we have had a creation challenge running for the last few weeks, and we're going to judge the top three uh, later on tonight and Image and Heap's going to help us judge them thank you Image and Heat as we now call you um, so if you want to be laser part of our community Imogen, please come and join people. say again Laser Imogen Laser, laser Imogen, Imogen. <laughs> Laser Imogen, Imogen. <laughs> Imogen. Call me Laser just call me Laser that should be your beatboxing name Imi Laser Laser Imogen um, so guys we've made three songs you're going to choose which one we're going to work on a bit more, okay? So let's go back over to menti.com. Let's go to menti.com. Use the code 96719059671905. 96719905. Kind of sounds like a 90s sort of, you know, like a landline, an old school mm. phone number. So I'm going to reset the results again. Reset results. And you have three choices to choose from. Oh, it's freaking out. Reset results. You have ch three choices, right? Option A is, do you want us to keep working on the first track we made, which was called Brooding But Hopeful? Mm -hmm. Option B is the second track we made. It was called Pink Moon. 
<laughs> That's Emmy's favourite. Well, option C was that one we just did, which was supposed to be upbeat and glittery, ended up being like very aggressive. Glitter bomb. So, do you want ironic glitter bomb? Glitter bomb. Option C. Pink moon. Option B. Brooding but hopeful. Option A. Thank you, Jackie Corey, for buying me a coffee. Oh Whoa. my days! Thank you very much. That's very kind of you. Uh, there's a message on there which I will read. Have a gin and tonic, much. please. Yeah, can we make Emmy's a gin and tonic, please, gang? Um, right, so I'm going to open the voting on this bad boy. Uh, so if you want to vote, go menti.com. Get your phone, go to menti.com and type in 9671905. You've got option A, brooding but hopeful. That was the first jam we did. Option B, pink moon, the second jam we did. In the league. Dedicated to Sophie. Then. Option C is glitter bomb, which was that monstrosity of aggression. <laughs> it means trying to influence the vote. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's looking pretty neck and neck, though, guys. So keep those votes coming in. It is menti.com, 9671905. I'm going to give you a little bit longer to vote. No one at all is voting for option A. It, yeah, can it you was hit, a bit lame. Can you hit me in the comments if you're trying to vote for option A, but it's not working? Because I'm getting like a <laughs> weird... There's an error here saying something went wrong which could be why no one's voting for A at all. It just seems a bit sus that no one's voting for A. Oh, thanks for the coffee, Vanessa. That's very kind of you. Thank you, so Vanessa. Never gonna get to sleep. If you're trying to vote A and it's not working, can you say it in the comments? I'm a bit scared. It says something went wrong, reload, but I'm a bit scared to do that in case it, in case it doesn't work. Uh, Lucy says glitter bomb was way too strong. Bard of many things says first one is always rough. I thought the first one was great. I was feeling it. I don't know why everyone's uh, hating on option A, but it's just not working. Um, okay, guys. Oh, there's a vote for option A, so it does work. Okay, I'm going to give you 10 seconds to finish up to vote for uh, Brooding But Hopeful, Pink Moon, or Glitter Bomb. Five, four, three, two. Oh, one last vote came in there for option A right at the last minute. <laughs> guys, we have a decision. We have a decision. Oh, thank you to uh, Trogtenstorn, who threw in a vote just to test it. That was very selfless of you to vote for something that you knew was going to lose. Uh, <laughs> but we have a winner, guys. Option B, which was our song called Pink Moon, uh, which I think we might need to. We might have to do it, guys. We might have to make a song. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to open up this guy, Ableton. Uh, and I'm going to, I am going to switch to my other microphone. Kind of going to go into studio mode now. Switch to my other headphones. Imi, tell us a story while I'm changing over. Tell us, tell us a joke. Once a time, there was a tall man called Shlomo. Not that tall, me. Called Shlomo, and. Then all of a sudden he was swallowed up by the dinosaur door <laughs> and he ate up his house, ate up his studio and all that was left was slow and his gear and, um, and he, he was forever in the door of Ableton, a door into a door, never to return again. It was a very sad story. But then... Um, he made a really great tune called Pink Moon with some bird. And it was a huge success. And he was released from the door of the door and uh, was able to return back to his earthly existence. That was a great story. I enjoyed that very much. Thank you. Um, can you guys hear me all right with my new... on, on this microphone? Does it sound Okay. This is, um, I, I normally do either a technical stream, either a live performance stream or a kind of, uh, or a studio stream, but this week we're doing both. So I'm just switching mode. Uh, if you can hear me all right, just tell me in the chat so I know it sounds nice and clear. Uh, apparently it sounds okay, that's good. Thank you. Uh, Lucy says, you can tell Immy is a mummy with her storytelling. Yeah. <laughs> Jocelyn says, I would watch that anime <laughs> anime <laughs> uh, 
Anim. 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 I haven't watched that Anim. So this is 140... No, what tempo is this? 140? No, that's the old one. Okay. I have now got a completely clean Ableton session open here. I don't know if you can see that. This is where you sped it up and it turned into this kind of munchkin land, pink name. We'll, we'll, we'll find the right tempo. I don't mind it. I quite like it. I'm gonna I mean, it. everybody speeds up my vocals all the time and then they put them into a rap song and then they make loads of money. So maybe it's a good, <laughs> maybe it's a good idea. Exactly. <laughs> Uh, okay, I'm going to bring in Endless Studio into this Ableton session. Boom. That's how easy it is. He says, initializing. Can you guys see that? Let's see. It doesn't seem to be doing much. Do, 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 okay. do, do, do. So we are going to find that jam, which I it's have no idea how yellow. to get back to it. I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it here because now it should be at the start, right? Wait a minute. Oh no, that didn't work. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm gonna. Here you go. I put it at the start. Can you hear it? Oh. Yeah. You... Oh, now I know why you voted for this, guys. That's a, that's lush. <laughs> but that wasn't. It wasn't like that. It was. At, it was at 147.37. Oh no, that's oh. the last one. One one four point three seven, I think it was. Oh, wait a minute. Please. Now that sounds sped up now, doesn't it? Yeah. Sorry. This is one thing I hadn't thought of. If the tempo changes. Yeah. The original tempo. If there's any endless people watching, is that is there any way of knowing what the original riff was? I think it was that. Oh no, wait, if you, yes, if you, um, you press autoplay on. Still sounds a bit sped up, doesn't it? Well, it did, it, it, you did, it did speed up at one point. It was like, in this bar, and then it, I think it's something you do, but it could have been something I do. That, that sounds... Do we like that? How do we how do we discover for real for real what it was? I don't know, but we can always change things later. It's really, really easy to do so. But um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag this guy into mm. Ableton. Okay, show you how easy it is. Link, do I just drag? Yeah, there it is. Oh wait, wait. I've got, oh, if you oh. fo if you don't follow transport hosts, sorry, clock source internal, it might tell. Yeah, there you go. So. Right, I'll find it. I'm gonna find it for you. Original tempo. I really like this, by the way. Say again. Ninety-seven point five one. Ninety-seven point five one. Oh, maybe that was before you sped it up. Wait, wait. Oh, I sped it up. Here, it? Such a nice jam. If it's sped up to a point where it's not in a um, like a recognisable key, yeah, <laughs> like that's quarter toned it. out of itself. Yeah. What? What? what key? I think if you ah, uh, should I try and find a key that works with the key? Yeah. Okay, wait then. Um, according to Ali, Ali G watching on Facebook, Ali G? it was, was 97.97. 97.97? 97 oh yeah, how do you know that? Oh yeah, you're right, because it was the palindrome. Wasn't it 9779? Right. 97. 97.79 or 79.97. Let's go with this for now. We'll, we can always change things later. Oh, ninety-seven right point uh, seven nine. We kind of want it to be in. 
You want it to be in a real key, really, don't you? It's either got to be in. Oh, you can't hear that, but. Zany like says, minor, does Endless separate the tracks in Ableton? Minor. Yes, it does. I'll show you in a sec. We're just going to get the tempo right and I'll show you how easy it is to bring it into Ableton. It's really fun. It is amazingly easy. What'd you say, Emmy? It's amazingly easy. It's geniusly easy. What'd you say before that? Was it something about getting it in? Oh, the key that we either A use? flat minor or A minor. Some We've got to choose because it's in between at the moment. And I'm Let's gonna, go A let's minor. Go let's do the white notes. A minor. Okay. Always. Right. <laughs> okay, wait. Let me, then, let me just... 98, let's try that. So if you hit create new loop, Emmy, then it will send that tempo to me as well. Okay, I'm just, I'm still trying to find. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's going to be quite significantly fast. So if you are wondering what's happening right here. Wait, 101.9. We are working on a track. That's called... Pink Moon that we wrote with your inspiration, guys. Uh, 102. Maybe he's just trying to find the right key and the right tempo for it, and then we're going to drag it into Ableton and kind of work on it a little bit, which is very exciting. This is what it sounds like. <laughs> Are you trying to tune it? Yeah. How am I going to get it? It's so hard to get it when it's like my <laughs> Try it at 102.3. This is good at it. 102.3. Hey, look who's just tuned in. Big up to Chesney Hawks. Actual Chesney Hawks just tuned in. Actual Hello, Ches. Chesney Hawks. Actual, Actual Chesney, Chesney Hawks. Hawks. Actual really? Chesney Hawks. The one and only. Uh, Chesney, you're going to have to jump on this stream one month. Come make some music with me. That'll be fun. So what have we decided, Emmy? Oh, I don't... Wait, just stop it. Big up to Cassia Zerman who's liked the stream. That's someone else I should get on the stream, Bunty. Do you know well, Bunty? Chesney would know. Chesney. Um, oh no, how would he be able to do that? Oh, basically. Chesney yeah. says hi, Emmy. Ah. He says I'd love hi. that, mate. Oh, I would love that. Um, oh well. Um, I'm just trying to find if I could play to Zoom stereo. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Hello. So we want it to be like la. And this is sharp at the moment, so this needs to go up, so it needs to go faster. 102.5. Let's try that. Is it, is it sharp or flat? It's so close. Chesney, you're like the tuning. Yeah, Chesney, you do the work. That's Chesney, you can't sharp, just sit there it? enjoying it. You've got work to do. You've got to help us tune this. I can't decide which way around it is. 102 point. Oh, are we being annoying and does it really matter? Um, well, we're getting love. Israel says, I love this. It's like actually being in the studio with you two legends. Oh, that's very kind of you. Chesney's very helpful feedback is sounds slightly out. Yes, it is. <laughs> Thanks, Ches. Thank you very much. That's very useful feedback. That's going to be our review. Like, you know, when you get the press reviews on your poster. <laughs> Five stars, The Guardian. Sounds slightly out, Chesney Hawk. <laughs> <laughs> but which way is it sharp or flat? Is the, is the tune, this is the tune. It's sharp, isn't it? <laughs> Three. So he says, "Sorry, <laughs> useless." <laughs> I thought it was quite useful. 
It's good to know. Hey, Emmy, let's go with let's go with close because we can tune it up in Ableton okay. later if we want to. Oh, Big up Nick Jones. Thanks for liking the stream. Let's try one more, one more try. It's getting further away. So maybe I don't have 1.9. Oh, shit. Sorry. 1.9.1. Okay. Go with, go with whatever you feel. What do you, what, what do you want at the moment? Oh, well, here we go. We've got a real expert. We've got a real expert here. Greg Beardsell, who is a... Uh, very accomplished choral leader. He says the track is sharp for the piano. Drop tempo by a few clicks. Did you catch that, Emmy? Yes, I am going, going that way. way. 101.75. It sounds so dreamy and airy. Big up Westmount Music. Thanks for liking the stream. So what tempo, what tempo are you on now, Legion? That's 101.9. 101. 101.55. 101. 101. Let's, Let's go with 101.55. Oh, really? <laughs> Ableton what? just disappeared. Literally just disappeared. Uh, it crashed. In the void. But I'm using Ableton uh, 11, the beta, which is maybe oh. less stable. Oh, look at you. You've got the beta. You've got the beta, <laughs> everyone. Oh, he's got the beta. <laughs> yeah, but if it's going to crash, we probably should. Use... I'm going to try live 10 this time. Uh, hello, everybody watching us being perfectionist. Uh, this is what we like to do. Okay, I'll write pink <laughs> moon while you do that. <laughs> keep writing, keep writing. Vibe when something's yes. just ever so slightly out because they, you know, they didn't have this micro tuning situation. Let's go, that let's do can. it 90s style. Ragtime vibe says Bard of many things. Yeah, that is what it is. Right, so I'm going to mute me so I don't. Okay. You want to hear? Ableton uh. is back. Let's try bringing Endless back in. Is it shuffle for that? Right, I'm gonna go 101.45. I'm gonna go 101.1, just like. Mason says it's space ragtime. <laughs> I like that. Pink Moon is space ragtime. If anyone asks what genre you produce. Uh, so, my jams. Let's go show my Imogen Heap. Whoa. What tempo did you say? <laughs> what tempo are we working point, on? Uh, 101.10 we're at the moment. 101. 101.10. I like it. Okay, Emmy, can you turn your input to me to not have your your playback on it? So I'm going to show everyone how easy it is to drag a track out of Endless and get the stems going in uh, in Ableton. It's as easy as this. Do the shift thing. 
Oh, you yeah, you hold down command and it just makes oh. a bunch of tracks. I'm going to group them. I'm going to call that group stems so I can easily mute them. And I'm going to mute endless. I'm also going to delete these redundant channels. I might keep that piano in case it's helpful. So let's see what we've got here. So angelic. It's really uh it's got a peaceful kind of mountain pink mountain vibe. So I feel like we've only got one, two, three, four, five channels here, but there might be some more juicy stuff in an earlier version of it. Maybe. 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 It'll, It'll be in the wrong. It'll be in the wrong. It'll be in the wrong. Because we, we, we can pitch it in. Can't we? Is that delay on your voice deliberate, by the way? What's that? What's that? There's an echo on your voice. Is that deliberate? Not entirely. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. Keep going, keep going. Yeah, and there you go. Oh, that's better. If you find any more nice, tasty bits of that jam, mm. then why, why don't you go scouting for that while I tidy these up a bit and make sure they're in time? Let's see what we've got here. So, there's our first layer. Lovely, kind of twinkly thing. It's very much kind of. It's kind of got some strange harmony in it. I like it. So there's your twinkly thing, and you got this guy. Which, uh, by it on its own, sounds kind of weird. Oh, I've got an idea. What's your idea? It originally, it's original tempo was 79.97 so really? what we can do is we can with endless 79 that is in key 79.97 so we can just pitch it up 79.17 that was the original original <laughs> You've probably got some weird settings in Ableton. I re-pitched so like, it. So it should now yeah. land in the right place. Is that what yeah, it sounds like in Endless? No, it's What does it sound like in Endless? Seven, but then we want to speed it up. Ooh, what's that tastiness? That was the start of it. It's very lovely. I can't wait to go back and rewatch the stream because that kind of just came out of nowhere. Did you put it at 79.97? Yeah. Yeah, because somebody said it was 97.97. They were nearly there. It was 79.97. 79.97. So we've got a couple uh. more channels here. There's these two ones that we haven't got. If I put in another couple of channels, I can drop them in. So I think you can just drag, yeah. How do you do it so that... Where's the thing in Endless where if you... Oh, it's, maybe it's in the settings. When you pitch it up, it pitches it up by... Oh, yeah, you can pitch by a semitone number of BPMs. Yeah, but where is that? Oh, uh, yeah, I think it's... I haven't seen that in the in the in the desktop version i've only seen that in the okay i'm going to do it on my app and i'm going to find do it. it on the ipad or the iphone it's it's much easier find this tempo um, go 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 do, 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 do. zuta nautil slapped a purple heart sticker thanks for doing that I'm assuming that's a happy bit of feedback you've given us. It's really 
really beautiful. Thanks. Oh, something like, like a something. stuttery thing. We've got a. Okay, wait. So if you go up to a hundred point seven six, that should be in the key of C. If we're going to go for the, the higher tempo. Okay, hang on. I'll just set the warp on these to repitch. What tempo did you say? Uh, mm -hmm. 100.76 Pretty good Yeah, okay good We're in business Okay, 100 That feels like F major to me That's in key Ethereal, yes. you're right Yes. Uh, Annie G says, Ethereal. Mason says, would you upload these stems so we can play with them? Maybe. We're going to try and make it into a thing. Lucy says, super therapeutic sounds. Yeah, and this is therapy for me, gang. I just love, just love messing around. <laughs> what have we got here? So this guy... Boxing. This is like a warm synth. What's this layer here? Stuttery. Do we already have that? Oh, we've got that twice. And what's this layer here? Got that twice as well. So should we? Should we think about building this up a little bit, I mean, structuring it a tiny bit? Yeah. Okay. Um, I feel like I'm going to save it because otherwise... I mean, it was it? Was it? 100.76. It's going in Jams album two, Endless Jams. Uh, Emmy. What's it called? Pink Mountain. Pink Moon. Oh, Pink Moon. Of course, it's not a mountain, it's a moon. My poor computer is not coping with live streaming <laughs> and doing all this stuff. Right, so where should we start? I think we should start with not that one, that should come in later. Or that one. Or that one. Yeah, it needs to start floaty, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I need to definitely That's start definitely with that. That's definitely your intro. Yeah. <coughs> That's definitely your intro. So I've put that at the beginning. And then I feel like that, I want that beat to come in here. But it should come in there. That's your one, isn't it? So if this is going to be a little bed for a thing about a pink moon. It's so floaty, isn't it? Can you want a little space here before some kind of drop happens? I feel like this bar here, I'm going to reverse it. And 
then we drop, right? Does that sound good? Sorry, I'm having annoying... I can't hear anything that I'm doing now, so I can't hear any... If I wanted to create something, I can't hear anything. Is that um, is that anything I'm doing wrong? <laughs> no, it's just because I was trying to stop you hearing my setup, and I did something to stop you hearing it, and now I, and now I can't get it back. Um... <laughs> Maybe it needs a little, just a one bar rest there. I've forgotten how you insert time. Insert uh, silence. Apple, Apple, Apple Shift I. Apple Shift I. Oh, done. Yeah, that's Apple I. Uh, that needs reverb on it, otherwise it just disappears. Mason says that twinkly stem would sound good a few octaves lower or higher. Let's do both, Mason. Let's pitch it down and up because huh, this is our song. We can do whatever we want with it. Uh, 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 going on. Minus 12. <laughs> That sounds really computer gamey. <laughs> Let me, I'll find a nice sound for you. I'll find a nice sound to go with that. I don't doubt, I don't doubt you. Actually, needs. I feel like it needs some slightly harder drums, like a kind of four to the floor type thing. Oh my goodness me! Sorry. How you doing, Em? Okay. I just have no idea why, but somehow my the output was muted. <laughs> Try and find a little. Find a drum kit here that can just my poor computer. Look at that spinning beach board, freaking out. It's unhappy because I'm trying to make it do too much. Well, I'm happy. How are you guys all doing at home there? I feel like uh, the interactivity has, has zipped down a little bit, whilst we kind of gone into geek mode. That is hard. Making a nice thing. Liz says we're still here. Thank you, Liz. Can you hear me now? Yeah, you can't can... hear my harmonizer, can you? I can't hear your harmonizer. I can hear you talking though. Bard of many things says great over here. Oh, I'm just yeah. making art. I'm really enjoying listening to your work. Oh, tell us, show us what you're making. Somehow, tweet it to us. Jacob Harry, what software is that? This is called Ableton Live. It is excellent software. Rob, fantastic. Just waiting for Immy to throw her computer across the room. Immy is no, not no, going to see No, no, it's fine. I'm totally used to it. Don't worry about me. She's totally okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I've got a nice thing coming. Okay. You just hang in there. You work on that. I'm working on these drums here. I'm wondering if that is too hard. But I've got a rule. If your brain tells you something is too anything, then you have to do more of it. Oh, 
we going to go for, um, are you are doing like, is that what we're doing? Is that what we're doing? Yes. Do you see how I confidently answered that? So this is mad. We can see Immy making some amazing music, but we can't hear it. It's going to come through endless when she's got it ready. Are you are you turning stuff into endless right now, Immy? I will be in a minute. Okay, cool. That's quite fun. Well, I haven't finished yet. Let's have a listen to it. still talk to you. I can't do that, can I? Um, I don't know. What, what you were trying to achieve? It's hard to, it's hard to work when I can hear you oh, yeah, playing you music in the background. Oh, I can turn my Ableton off so you can't hear my Ableton, if you want. But then, will other people... Yeah, I can still do a loop back so that others can still hear me. Uh, I think I should be able to do that. As long as I remember to put it back on again. Uh yeah, so can you can you hear me talking but not hear my music? Now? Yeah. Yeah, great. vocally thing down an octave see what that sounds like so apple j consolidates so i'm free to pitch it down if i so desire or put it any or up anywhere so beautiful. This is a kind of sketch, I guess. I'm really uh, 
I'm really intrigued just to what Amy's working on over there. She's got her head down. She's got her gloves on. <laughs> She's making something. Um, not making that much stuff, actually. I'm just... I just made a little thing. You can drag it in if you like. It's not finished. Really. Maybe it is. I don't know. Oh, look. Endless has gone all funny colours. What's that? Why is that doing that? Oh, that's tasty, Amy. So as you can see, the legend that is Imogen Heap is sending me tracks through the internet. There's a stuttery one and there's a straight one. So I'm going to make a channel for it. Make a channel for it up here, actually. That's nice. That's nice of me. Is that is that sequence supposed to start on the higher chord, Emmy? No, lower chord. Okay. Oh, I don't know where your song is at the moment, but it's like. So, it'd be on that F. Mm. Wait a minute, let me try. Right, I'll, I'll do it against. Do you feel any? Do you feel anything lyrical coming into your head? Because just then, when you no. were just humming it to me there, I was thinking that's cool. Do you think we should harness the power of these people watching to give us some lyrical ideas to mess around with? Oh, why not? Shall we? Yeah. Okay. If anyone is still out there, late at night on a Thursday. <laughs> Do you want to help us write this song? Um, let me see who's there. Oh, there's loads of people watching. Oh, this is great. <laughs> there's loads of people watching. Hello, guys. All right. So, what if we go back on Menti? Ah, middle of the afternoon in LA. You're just chilling, doing your art in the middle of the afternoon. Good for you. All right. I'm going to go back to this guy here. Can you see that? All right. Um, we need some lyrical ideas, please, people. Go back to menti.com. Type in that code again. I'm going to change it to give us... Can you see that? Give us some lyrical ideas. Uh, so all you've got to do is go to menti.com, type in that code 9671905 uh, and tell us. <laughs> I see some stuff coming in the comments. That's lovely, but put it, put it on the uh, put it on the menti rather than on the chat just so that we can see it all in one place. Why did that just change? God's bathroom floor. So what 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 lyrical ideas can we think of? Like words that can we can use to turn into some poetry or something, you know? 
karma comes for us all. <gasps> oh. This is lovely. Let me run the beat for you so you can hear the vibe. <laughs> The Menti code is 9671905. You can see it there at the top of the screen. What you yeah. up to? Are you st are you still doing cool stuff in Endless? Because I'll go and listen to it. Yeah, you should you should you should hear it. Okay, cool. Um, can you see on the screen here? There's some uh, mad quantities oh, of lyri some lyric. lyrical ideas. Okay, you, cool. You have a look. Oh, the lyric. Nice. Oh, that's good. Pink when you died too soon. Okay. What have we got here? Endless. Look at all these things Emmy's been doing. Let me. sent some nice things i love it it's like presents it's like christmas keeps arriving turn you back in now i just couldn't find a way to mute what you were doing while i was playing playing practicing no worries let me just quickly copy that there. all right do you want to hear what we've got yeah have you, have you just been putting even more cool stuff in emmy i just put, I put some beat i put a beat in i can't remember what you've got over there so i've turned you so you can hear my ableton again hang on boom right you should be able to hear this so i'm a bit off piece <laughs> This is our beautiful floaty intro.
Don't get that. Bing, 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 So wonky. Say, my friend. You've got auto warp on. Uh... So it's all weirdly out of time. Is that not how you played it? No. I mean, it's just kind of going in and out. It's like. How was it? On. How was it supposed to be? If you double click it, and then just click. Take warp off. Is that not how you yeah. is that not how you heard it? I think it's pretty cool. We can have a play around with it. Hello. It just sounds obviously brighter and nicer in my headphones because it's not going through. Yeah, you're here. You're here in the nasty yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. phone call version. Yeah. Um, but so okay. listen, there's a couple of things. Someone just uh, reminded me that we are we're judging, but we've got oh. we, we've got a competition to judge that I'd completely forgotten about. I've completely forgotten oh, about. No. Thank, Come thank on you, in. shamanic beatbox, for reminding me about that. Let's do that now. Let's have a little break from this uh, work of genius. <laughs> And uh, here's some other people's genius. So, if you have just joined us, my name is SK Shlomo. I'm here with the legend that we call Imogen Heap. And every month I set my community a creation challenge. Uh, there's a whole bunch of us who make music together. And there's three pieces that have been made. I gave them a very simple brief, which was new beginnings, because we said it in January. We've got three pieces of music here, guys, that I want you to listen to and decide who you think wins to deserve the, deserves to win the prize which is a sure mic bundle courtesy when are you going to sure. actually play it because i need to go for a wee okay you go for a wee okay. <laughs> whilst i chat to these guys um and then we'll play it in a moment so if you want to be part of our community we have a free currently a whatsapp group is where our community lives um, it is called the Creation Lounge, although we are probably going to move to a more stable place than WhatsApp. But for now, if you go slow.link slash WhatsApp, you'll be joining our little group. Uh, and next week I am doing a kind of community session with my group. So I go live every Thursday and this time next Thursday, we're going to work in this same way using Endless, but I want to see how it feels to do it with a group. So it's going to be a group of us making music together in real time. Uh, and we'll have a Zoom room full of people making music. There's only a few places in the Zoom room and you can only get them if you're in our community. So if you go to slow.link slash WhatsApp, you can join our group and I'll be sending out some information there tomorrow or over the weekend of how you can register to be in our stream this time next Thursday and make music with us together. Um, and when Immy gets back, you're going to get to hear three pieces of music created by the community, all using live looping or um, music technology of some description. They had a brief. They had three minutes to fill, and they had to make something around the theme of new beginnings. Should we hear them? So this is the top three. Had loads of entries. These are the three I like the best. Option A. Contestant A is... <laughs> Subsonic. Can you hear that, Amy? Yeah, yeah. This is 
Big Stop. Big Stop. Big Stop. Big Here's your first entry, that's Subsonic. We like that very much. Nice. Right, Subsonic. Bit reduction. We like a bit of bit reduction. Yeah, that's really, really fun. Crowd's going crazy here. Big up all I the like here for Subsonic. Big up. Subsonic is bloody good, says Garang Sonny. I agree. Subsonic is bloody good. Bard of many things says, this is a fun beat. Robo Soap says, where did I put my ecstasy? I can't help you with that. At least not on air. <laughs> yeah. So that was Subsonic. That was our first contestant. Are you ready for our second contestant? I said, Are you ready? Something disappeared. I was enjoying that. Susanna Fairbairn. Oh, let's go back to Fiona. Let me skip it. Susanna's a soprano, opera singer. This is her first looping thing she's done. vision of the last year. <laughs> Moments of beauty. Well done, Susanna. Thank you for that. That was cool. If, if the feedback and everything wasn't deliberate, 
Uh, all you got to do is wear headphones when you use an app like Loopy, so it doesn't sample right. itself. But, but it was pretty cool. I love like what that. you did. I love like what you that. created. Yeah. And the final one, guys. We're going to have a crowd vote as well, guys. So crowd concentrate. So you had, uh, you had uh, Subsonic, you had Susanna, and here's our final finalist. Tom. I've got to give you some context for this. Hang on. hang on, hang on, before I play it. I need to give you some context, because Tom... <laughs> do you know what's very interesting about this? Tom, he won he won our challenge a few weeks back, which is why he's called himself Tom Yamaha Speakers, because he won some Yamaha Speakers. And this yeah. entry that he's put in, he's, he's, he's quite wild with copyright. He doesn't really care where he gets his music from. This song that he sent today samples the other two finalists. So the beat you're hearing is subsonic, and the opera and flute you're hearing is <laughs> Susanna. <laughs> Okay, let's hear it, let's hear it, let's hear it. I forgot to say, the brief was to break the test. Thanks for reminding me, guys. I forgot much of our community into one piece well done thomas I don't know, last week or two weeks ago this person tom won one and then the next week no i don't even know where he got the audio he's found some of susanna he's found some of subsonic he's mashed them together so this is all a bit like so subsonic was option a susanna was option b and then option C is a remix of Susanna and Subsonic created by Thomas. So whilst you're thinking who you're going to vote for, Emmy, I'm going to ask the crowd who they'd like to vote for. Uh, should we go? Should we jump back onto um, onto this beautiful thing? Don't worry, I've still got all your lyrics stored on there, guys. It's not going to get lost. But I'm going to set up a quick vote on here, and we can choose who wins. So was it option A? Which was subson subsonic? So option B, Susanna. Or option C, Tom. How much weight does my vote carry? Is it just one vote? You get one vote, the audience okay. gets one vote, and I get one vote. Okay. That's good. Okay. But I might not make my vote until. Uh, when am I allowed to make my vote? You're going to make your vote after the crowd make theirs. Crowd, the okay. voting is open. So go to menti.com. Use the code 9671905. Oh, here they come. Here they come. Here they come. They're flying in. Oh, option C is very popular with the early beginner, early starter votes there. 
coming in at a uh, joint second. We have uh, option A and option B. Keep those votes uh, coming, coming in. The, coming in the tail C, perhaps by a few hundred yards. Option B. <laughs> So I forgot to say that the brief, was, the brief was to break your tech because I set the challenge during a particularly challenging technical stream that I did where everything went wrong. <laughs> and I said how uh, pretty much everything I've ever done that people, other people thought was good was me breaking stuff and getting it wrong. Oh. So I told them, go break your tech, which I think Susanna did a brilliant job of. She did. Yeah, definitely. If that, if that was the brief. Yeah, break, break your tech and create something about new beginnings. So I can see the votes coming in. I'm going to give you a few more seconds. I'll give you 10 more seconds. 10, 9, 8, nine. <coughs> uh, Thomas says, you're one of the most talented guys in the business. I'm not sure who you're talking to there. I'm assuming me because, you know. Oh, Susanna says, Emma, you're coming across with a huge echo. That's strange. I can't hear that. Is it going? Uh, is that my fault? Is it going out twice? Right, voting is closed. We have a crowd vote, guys, which is option C, which was Thomas there. But in a way, it's everyone because he used everyone. But uh, Thomas has got the crowd vote. Well done. Round of applause for you. Emmy, uh, would you like to... Would you like to place your vote? I'm very indecisive. Um, musically, my favourite was option A. Um, but for the purposes of fitting the brief, I'd say option B. But um, <laughs> I did have a, a high amusement factor for C. So I like the way you've yeah. praised everyone. That's very good. Ah. Um, I mean, fitting the brief, I'd go for B. Okay, but I like the I, I like the idea of the man in his basement subsonic. Is it is is that the first guy? Yeah, option A. I like the idea that I mean I was just imagining. I was, if, does he have headphones on when he's making that music? Is he in a block of flat? Where is he living? Are there people around him when he's <laughs> yeah, yeah. And having a rave in his <clears throat> in his wherever he is? I love it. Um, so yeah. hang on, what was, what was the answer oh, there? What did who did you choose? Um, can I give a third to each? You're going to give a third to each. <laughs> Between you and Chesney, it's been the most uh, vague help. But, you know, I'll take any help. That's what we're here for. Vague help Thanks. is still good help. All right, so you're, <laughs> you're giving it a draw to all three. A third. Third, third, equal thirds. Well, that does leave um, Thomas in the lead with option C at the moment, um, which means I get to choose... I get to vote. I'm not going to do that now. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to announce it on next week's stream when we do our community oh, stream. No, suspense. So this time next week, we're going to have another live stream where we use Endless to create music together. Apart from this time, you guys are going to be working with me. And I'm going to have a Zoom room full of people working together. If you want to be in that Zoom room, you've got to be in our WhatsApp group. That's how I'm going to tell people about it. So go and join that now. Shlo.link slash WhatsApp. Um... Big up to Cloud Cord watching on YouTube. He says, thanks to Laura from Transmute for bringing me here. Ah, big up, Laura. I'm, I'm I was booked to do something with Transmute in February, but they've moved it. I'm not sure when that's happening now. Um, okay, so shall we have one more li little look at this, uh, what we've made, Imi, before I go and faint, because it's been a long night. It's been very, very, yeah. very fun. Yeah. Thank you so yeah. much for being here with me, Imogen. It's been really fun to spend time with you and yeah. somehow connect. It's been nice. It's been very chilled and... Um, I wish I had less like routing issues over here, but um, yeah, it's really, really nice and just great to share, you know, Tim's good work on Endless because I think it's it's already changing my life. Um, it's already helping me to kind of access that flow so much quicker. You know, at any moment you could be like literally waiting in a queue to get into a Tesco, <clears throat> and you're just like, jump on just Endless. Get in there. Yeah, it's so good. It's much better than scrolling on a social media feed. That's for sure. So guys, go and get Endless. If you have an iOS device, it's free. It's very, very powerful. And you can jam with people like me and Imogen Heap. Um, so let's listen to what we made, gang. Um. I'd like to click, would you? Very nice song. Give it to the 
cloud wrappers. <laughs> the Pink Moon Cloud Wrap Crew. Three. I'll put something in that gap. So incredibly chilled out. It just wasn't what I was expecting us to make, but I like it. Kind of opens the door into a different room in a club at that point, doesn't it? Yeah. line that's just completely out of tune with everything say there me i was just saying you need to make more of a feature of the old high one because that's the that just has chill vibes the like like the chill, on the, chill on the hair type thing that, yeah. that blue the one at the start yeah put it here so you get this little reverse one two three now It's very beautiful. It's just a big floaty cloud of pink moon. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you pink moon, written by you guys <laughs> and us in real time. It's been fun. I uh, I think that's got some legs. Uh, my instinct is to now sort of stay up for another six hours and dive into it and just make something. But uh, I feel if I do that, I might. You'll regret it tomorrow morning. Yeah, like my, <laughs> my brain CPU is going to, the fan's already on. <laughs> mm. But this has been so fun. Thank you, everyone who's been part of this. We've had a really, really fun night. Thank you for all of the love. Uh, that is a gorgeous track. It's part of many things. Uh, love Pink Moon, says Liz. Thomas says, this is a great way to mix rap music with democracy. Thank you very much. I didn't even know that's mm. what we were doing, but that's cool. Uh, Rip says it's James Blakish. Lucy says it's like we're in another dimension. Wibbly wobbly timey wimey. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks everyone. This has been really fun. A massive, massive love to my super special guest, Imogen Heap. I do this every Thursday. Every Thursday, I'm doing some kind of musical experiment. Uh, so please follow, join in, spread the love. Come and be part of it every Thursday. It's what's keeping me sane while I can't go off and do my shows. Big love to Immy. Big love to your family as well. Um, and uh, can you tell us again how we can get hold of the the the, the Glover, the new product that you launched today? Uh, go to memeogloves.org. Let me just double check. <laughs> um, I should know that off my heart. There's obviously. a free there's a free trial, isn't there? Yes. Um, oh, I can't get online. That's typical, isn't it? Don't I'll worry, we'll, 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 post, gloves, we'll post the link. In the, in mi.mu. Mi.mu. Mi. 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 Um, I forget the dot sign, it doesn't work on it. This, on this, this, this whole page. stream will be watchable again immediately after we've finished. So you can rewatch that on my YouTube, on my Facebook, Imogen's Facebook, on my Twitch. Yeah. So if you want to recap anything we've done, you totally can. It is archived. Thank you so, so much, Imi. Lovely to see you. Thank you, everyone who's been part of it. Thanks for helping us make Thank big moves. It's been good. We will Thank see you again. Next Thursday, 8.30 UK time. Thank you for all the coffees, all the love, and we will see you again. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. goodbye.